In this wordplay review video, I'm going to be showing you everything you're going to want to know about this AI copywriting tool. If you have any questions, go ahead and drop them below. I tend to reply within a few minutes to a couple of hours, and I'll also leave a special discounted link that I'll keep updated so you always get your money's worth for wordplay. So I'm actually pretty excited about showing you guys wordplay because I have reviewed tons of copywriters and this is the first software that really is coming up with an all-in-one solution. So let's just jump straight into this. Here we are on the dashboard. You have a basic search feature as well as where all your projects are listed. On the left, you have your sidebar. You have create content, your usage, the add-ons, your billing, and then your logout. Inside create content, one of the first things I would recommend is to click the see instruction. This will give you a bunch of demo videos showing you how to use the software. Although the chances are you're probably not going to need to watch them because it's really very simplistic. The software is divided into three core areas. You have the create new article, which is where you create manual articles. You then have the bulk creation mode, which is where you can create articles in bulk via an Excel document. And then you have the AI mode, which is literally everything for you. We're going to start off with the create new article. So the first thing that you do is enter a descriptive title. So I'm going to start talking about training cats. Okay, so how to train a cat to sit easily. Okay, and then for article sections, it's recommended to do a minimum of three subheadings or 12 subheadings and each subheading goes on a single line. Uh, subheading one, which is going to be top tip to train a cat to sit. And then the second heading is going to be how to prove yourself and then I'm going to do best treat you uh, once you've added in up to 12 subheadings I'm gonna go ahead and do proceed and submit so this article is going to be about 450 words it should be ready within round about 60 so oh it's now ready okay so go ahead and click preview and I'm gonna pause the screen so you can have a look at the output quality but this is basically what uh, it's generated you can then do quick copy and paste it into a document or you can download it in in a Excel doc. So if we do download as HTML sections, open it up, and then it's broken down into subheadings just like so. And it's the same with the HTML title body. I would actually like to see that in a notepad format or maybe a document or something instead of two Excel sheets, but it's still in its early days. We're now gonna give the bulk creation mode a whirl. And if you're not sure what template to use or how to format it, just click the download content template open it up and then you've got all of your subheadings so it's basically enter the title here and then on each new line enter the title for each one and then do the subheading and again do the exact same and then subheading 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 so we're going to go ahead and upload the csv and then it will populate the fields below with all the input and we're just going to call this carpenter book add a description and then do proceed it's now starting to generate each of these articles so just from that small little sheet it's generating five articles for us. Each one of these articles should be completely unique. So whilst we're waiting for that to populate, let's go ahead and try the AI mode. And we're also going to put this through a plagiarism test to see if it is really just creating new documents or not. How to train a dog to sit easily. Okay. And then the project name, dog training AI. Okay. And that's literally it. So we don't need to include our subheadings or anything, and it should be a thousand words. So let's go ahead and do submit. Okay. Okay. So that dog training article is now complete. We're going to go into view and then preview. So we're just, I'm going to pause the screen so you can have a look at it, but just quickly going over the titles. So it's how to train a dog to sit easily. And then what is a good dog set? Why is it so hard to train my dog to sit to be successful? Your training needs to be consistent for us, make your pet earn the treat and each of these titles are actually a pretty good title so i'm inside grammarly and i pay for the premium which means i get the plagiarism uh, checker and if i go ahead and click on plagiarism anything over 15 percent i'm going to think is not that good but anything under i think is really good anything under 10 percent plagiarized is I'm, I'm really happy with and anything under five percent well we're laughing okay i just realized it pasted the code instead of the title so let's try that again okay so it's only done one percent 
plagiarized, which means from a thousand word article, that is absolutely superb. Now, one worthy note is if you have a WordPress blog, what you can do is install this plugin to your WordPress website, and then anything that's been generated in WordPlay, you can import directly into your WordPress posts. Okay, so we're back in the bulk creator section, um, and my only problem with this is it's taking a little far too long to generate each article for me. Um, it's just finished one of the articles after about five minutes. So I'm actually not sure um, this feature is better than the single article creator. I imagine it actually is probably faster just to do each article through the single uh, creator. But either way, if you've got like hundreds of blog posts, then probably pulling it through this, but it is going to take some time. Um, I think I've been waiting around about five to 10 minutes just for this one. But if we had a look at preview, this is what it looks like. And we're going to go ahead and put this through the plagiarism checker again, paste this in, and that's 2% plagiarized. So one really important thing before I give you my thoughts of this software, and that is whenever it comes to AI writing tools or copywriting tools that kind Kind of do all the writing for you, you should always apply the 80-20 rule, which is 80% of the heavy lifting should be done by the software, and then 20% should be done by you, which comes into fact checking and some grammar correction and some layout formatting and stuff like that. Now, word play is a little bit different because it's trying to do 100% of the writing for you. And what's good about it is actually it's pretty good quality output and it's unique output. But there's still going to be elements of fact checking that you should really make sure you check and correct. So overall, I think WordPlay is brilliant. Honestly, I actually think they've done a fantastic job creating the all-in-one copywriter. Of course, there's still things that they're going to have to tweak, but so far, it generates fantastic articles with ease, no glitches, no iffy bits and bobs and what's not. It just works and it works well. So the question is, would I recommend Wordplay to a friend? Yeah, absolutely. Go buy Wordplay whilst the offer is on. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.